Hey guys, I'm Ronnie here with your weekday update. Physical parking de decals will soon be a thing of the past. Starting this fall, passes will be associated with the car's license plate number. In addition to the cost for the electronic pass, students who prefer to back in will also be charged an additional $50 to do so. Members of the tennis team will be taking flight at the NCAA tournament. The women's tennis team will compete against the 14th ranked South Carolina Gamecock on May 12th. The men's tennis team will also take the court at the University of Georgia from May 24th until the 29th. A UNF student has been charged with allegedly cyber-stalking another UNF student. According to JSO, UNF freshman Dylan Strickland made multiple social media accounts using the victim's pictures advertising gifts sent in exchange for sexual activities. Strickland's bond is set at over $50,000, and he is expected in court on May 24th. There may soon be a new way for Florida college students to pay for classes. The Senate passed a bill that could implement block tuition as soon as fall of 2018. Block tuition is taking 15 credits but only having to pay for 12, so students will buy four classes and essentially get the fifth free. This switch is an attempt to reward students for graduating in four years instead of the average 4.8 for a UNF student. In order to make up for this potential 20% loss, universities may raise tuition and fees to make up for this deficit. There may be a new fraternity on campus soon. AE Pi, a Jewish fraternity, is pushing to join the nest. Earlier this year, an anonymous email stated that a UCF AE Pi brother held a rifle to the head of a blindfolded pledge. The potential chapter hopes that this incident does not affect their chances on becoming an official fraternity on campus. They are still in the process of applying. Don't forget to like us on Facebook for all things campus news and visit UNF Spinnaker for all of our stories. With Spinnaker News, I'm Ronnie Rogers.